now. Uh, yeah, there's no point in going there. Let's go down already. And check this door. And if I can, if I can, then I'll check there. Damn. Set point here, but no. There was a good mark. Uh, oh, maybe that's a baby. You know. Uh, bing. Okay. Let's leave it there. Down as well. Mm, it must be around here. The bell will not stop ringing. I hear it tingling even. Uh, it is tingling even in my dreams. My hands are wounded from all the digging. Uh, it must be around here. Just one more wound. I hear it close by. Oh, hang on. Oh, and I also need second gem. Oh, that also. Oh no, maybe it's blocked. Okay, so now I have to mark here as well that I need. Uh, well, it's kind of a sphere, but it's bluish. So let's mark as that. No, it's not bluish. Uh, it's actually greenish. Okay. But let's mark as that. Oh, I can I just restore? No, thank. I I won't. Um, let's go up because if it's a hard path, I think it will look back down. But if it's a hard path, it will probably be easier to drop back, drop down, then climb. It's here.
Oh. Well, that's exactly why I was sitting, by the way. Uh, what was that again? I don't remember. Uh, oh, no, it's yourself. The oil of pilgrims. Yes. Ah, it's another bar. Check here for. I have equipped again. Uh, that thing is for protection is toxic great. Jump! Okay, now dash, dash. What's that? Black grieving veil. Uh, dark cloth there. Has kept its silky fields by the passing of the years. One of the three remaining of an unfinished ceremony. The wounds inflicted by a broken oath rarely ever find healing. Uh, what was the other one? Ah, the bridal ribbon. Okay, so uh, it does say one of three remains. Uh, who is looking for those? Okay, let's skip down. Uh, hang on, this area seems suspiciously. I can't jump down here. Empty. Oh, damn. Uh, hang on, I passed already. Uh, uh, maybe I'll need double jump to break here. Uh, I don't know that. So if I look that on the map, I'll remember that it is an unexplored place. It's a place I couldn't get through. Maybe I even can, I just don't know how yet. Uh, oh, it's a break. are gonna be troublesome. Oh! Oh, his spine was still attached. Oh. Uh, acquire uh, Metacarpus of Hodges, the blacksmith. Uh, blacksmith Brandon Hod Hodges forged some of Custodia's most beautiful weapons, wielded by the anointed legion themselves. Destiny wanted it to be one of his weapons that killed it. <laughs> that killed him. Okay. 
Oh, that reminds me of that Smith from Hollow Knight. That wanted to build his surge. Uh, what's up with those guys? That was the net. That seemed like a dead end. Oh. Okay, and I'll be able to climb that. Just great. Oh, but he gets in the way of my climbing. Oh, and he bashes the woman. Okay, he died. Whoa, there's an... Whoa, he's starting to shoot. Uh, I mean... How does something that is already split apart... Can get hurt from a surge? Seems oh, it's a boss, it's a vampire. Oh, it doesn't have health, like oh, ah, it's a Valkyrie. He didn't die yet. Perpetual protection. What's that? Uh, ribbon of crimson cloth, perfect rolled and still scented with ancient oils. Uh, members of the Anointed Legion wrap their bodies in the soft ribbons, anointed with protective oils, which contrast contrasted with their otherwise heavy armor. The determination of its former wearer offers protection against. Lightning attacks. Uh, uh, what's that? I have no available offer news. Okay, but I didn't kill her yet. Oh, damn. If there's a guy bashing the wall here. Uh, hey, it's like those guys from uh, Metal Slug. Oh, uh, you're not. Oh, okay. Sorry. Oh, penitent one. We traverse strange roads under the same firmament. With nigh other trade, nigh other name. My name is Redento, barefoot pilgrim of the Order of the Genuflectors. What's a genuflector? Prithi taketh nigh affront in my not looking at thy visage. For we, at each moment, lean forth so as not to divert our eyes from the path. 
Such is our old precept. We are before Hondo, a great buried bell, oh. erected upside down so that its ringing would make the earth tremble and oh. reach distant lands. We're inside the bell. Now Hondo resoundeth in a deep triune moan that traveleth in echoes through its broad spiraling circles. My feet wish to cross to the other side of this ancient valley to move on to the next destination. Oh, my sins, who could help me? Uh. I halt here to look for a crossing to the other side so as to continue my penance in wandering. Ah, don't let it be a disturbance to thee, penitent in guilt, for my feet will find their long-awaited walking. Penitent one, may thy trade silence neither thy spirit nor thy frame. Uh, I don't think I can grab that. Chain. gonna be a, a problem eventually oh Carlos the Executioner. Then I got an ex Executioner already. Consular, Nurse, Performer, Grave Digger. Ah, uh, maybe it was the Grave Digger that I was mistaken. Uh, his hatred for people was as great as his love for animals. When he was offered to execute a dog that had beaten a bishop, Carlos refused for the first and last time. Uh, Ah, oh, that uh, wooden spikes thing that I I've seen that in a clip. those hurt me I'm not sure if they hurt me
Oh, yeah, they respawn when I rest. Oh, danger. an enemy. Uh, it seems like a bad idea. Okay, so far nothing, but we're gonna figure out a way to make things bad for us. so bad. Oof. Oh! Oh! That wasn't fair. Alright, so... Oh, good. of Linquis, the forger. Whenever a bell rings in Custodia, it sounds owes its existence to Linquist. This forger never saw his bizarre magnum opus called Hondo completed. That's gonna be bad. Oh, and it continues here.
Oh, Bouquet of Rosemary is the third one. A bunch of... oh no. Uh, oh, I thought it was like a bouquet of flowers. <laughs> okay. A uh, bunch of aromatic... Well, it technically is, but I thought it was a wedding bouquet. A uh, bunch of aromatic herbs common not long ago along the force of the Holy Trail. Today, however, their scarcity makes them increasingly valuable, especially for those who discern their healing abilities. Oh, oh no, I killed! Ugh. Number of the beasts have I killed 666 enemies. But there's still something else I can check over here. Hit it. Uh, another door, but I think there's a shortcut over here. This chain, the foreground is quite a nice detail. I didn't pay attention so far. Oh, it's I'm gonna die here. Oh, okay, it's not a continuous path. Isn't part of the holy purge? Uh, uh, sword core blessed with fervent prayers can be inserted into mea culpa, increase the tears of torment ripped, but prevents to use by no, that's really bad. This is, yeah. That's really bad. No. Oh, there's lore as well. Uh, the Legend of Mea Culpa, the Sword of Guilt. 
It is said that this stone statue covered with petals was once a young woman who, tormented by a deep feeling of guilt, struck her chest with the figure of her father, asking him to be punished. Uh, the miracle manifested itself in the figure of the father, emerging from her a wide and long blood edge, a great rooted sword which pierced her guilt, her guilty heart, in, uh, to later transform her body into a statue. The sword was called Mea Culpa, in allusion to the last words of the young woman. Uh, I read those, didn't I? Uh, beautify. Oh, my first conference, the visions of those scene. Yeah. I think I read those when I got last time. Uh, let me see, did I miss? Oh, I didn't get, I forgot about those. Okay. Uh, this I had read. In number two, uh, no one knows what they asked for in the prayer, nor why they didn't want to be wedded. The miracle, with its grievous plans, went to the aid of the sisters, if you can call that aid. Uh, it's based on that. Confessions of Tirso, part 5. Congregation members, witness of the phenomenon, uh, watched in astonishment and fear, except for one of our sisters, who knelt beside me, and, without fear of contagion, kissed one of the terrible sores that the affection had caused on the young man. And the wound began to close. The brothers fell to their knees amidst tears and prayers. Uh, that's how their church started. Uh, and I got that as well. Uh, Esdras, you say, spoke the soldier, the madman could not bear the death of his sister. Uh, is that guy that's coming, following me? He's still talking to her as if she, wa she, she were there beside him. Sometimes it even seems as if they were arguing. Uh, he's long gone and hasn't been seen since. Uh, Uh, those don't have. Okay. Now uh, I can keep going up, uh, but it, it's considered the same path. Uh, yeah, let's enter here. Ah, uh, oh, quick silver. It's for upgrading the flasks. Uh, oh, I'd like to know which color is that? Is that still... Yeah, it's a similar color. Oh! Is that for me to hit and jump? No, I don't think I can really do that. I think I'll have to do that, but uh, I don't think that will work right now. Oh! I better you.
Oh, I came back here. Ah. Beneath the earth, uh, the paths are misleading. This is the lie that haunts these tunnels. Uh, the howl of the wind and the war of the waves can be heard, not, and yet there is no wind or sea, not, not even the blue flame atop the masts or our hands. Blue flame. Which blue flame? Okay, I don't think I can. Maybe I should have used... Oh no, this is possible. Uh, this seems bad. No, I missed. I I don't have any more tasks. Be good to know. Can't. Uh, let's mark another one of those. Oh. 
Hmm. Seems dangerous. That was part of the system. Oh, no, no, no! Oof. I got scared. Ah, <laughs> oh, great. Mirabalas Mirabras of the Return to Port. A festive song that was used to welcome back sailors who, having been left for dead and drowned in the cold waters, somehow managed to make it back to shore. Invoking it will transport you to the last video we should pray. Oh, this is pretty good. So I can. It's a homeward bone. Uh, and I just have to equip it here whenever I need it. Lady of the Blue Light, cast out the shadows from my corner. Take away the darkness from my looking glass where the light has died. Lady, bring us warmth. With your lamp of the sun, take away the cold, take away the ice from the sea of pain. Good. Uh, that was just... Okay, there's a second floor here. Hey, what's that? Uh, can I? I can't, not from here. Uh... Okay, I need a, a double jump here as well. Um, here, let's mark it with that. Uh, that wasn't a chest really, but I don't know what that was. Can I? No. Here. Oh, hang on, there was another door over there. Uh, no. Uh.
Oh. What's that thing there? It looks like a helm or something, but you know, it looks uh, pickable from the ground. Uh, maybe from here I'll be able to get that. Come on, guy, turn around. the blue light. Die! <laughs> How much health does this have? I'll need a jump anyway. I won't be able to get there just from here. of the sister. Oh, the one that died. Uh. <coughs> hey, is that the one I fought? Penitent one, you stand before the tomb below which my name, Perpetua, rests. And with it, a body vanquished a long time ago. Although we were already introduced through the wounds of our confrontation, mm. the audacity of your faith now gives us the chance to meet once again. A meeting behind the back of a miracle that ends up knowing all. You were able to defeat the lie created by the miraculous zeal that possessed my face and armor but not my voice uh. which is now free of sin and dominion however i see in you that the guilt that weighs so heavily in both your heart and hands is deserving of such arduous penance such is your strength that my brother esdras Convinced that you will commit crimes against the church, has asked for my blessing to prevent you accessing such a sacred place. Penitent one, I have seen a different path for you, whose ultimate destination is neither the forbidden nor the sacred places 
kept behind the high walls of Mother Church. Rise above all that, above even the halls of the dream. This voice of mine is limited. It cannot disperse all the invisible mists that tangle up the truth and mislead us. You must meet with my brother. He will be waiting for you on the bridge that leads to the door of the Holy oh, Visages. Let's turn it there today. Take this scapula, whose sheen will tell him you have my blessing, and before which he will surely fall to his knees, as he loves me deeply. At that moment, my soft whisper will reach his ears, beseeching him to assist you. Complete scapula. Go fearlessly, penitent one. Uh, incomplete scapula. Scapula. Ah, okay. I thought it was part of her bones that I would take to him. Half of a scapula. Uh, with an effigy of the twisted one that hangs at the end of the fine crimson cord. Uh, these words, almost worn away by the repeated caresses of Zello's fingers, are carved into the polished wood. Even at a distance, we are together, always, Estrus. The battle is over at last, brother. Do not concern yourself with my wounds. When my eyes close, the miracle will take me to with the father. Here, uh, this is half of my scapular. Remember that if you manage to reunite the two halves, it will be because I wish it to. I wish it so. My brother, dry your tears. Although I must go, my voice will be yours forever. Oh, this area is a different color. 